In this demonstration, I'm going to show you how you can restore snapshot using MariaDB Schema Manager. So, uh, when we are talking about snapshots, uh, this is taken with the stash backup session, and the initialization process would be done using stash restore session as well. Uh, in case you are not familiar with stash, it's a Kubernetes operator which can take backup and restore database snapshots and, uh, and a lot more. Uh, in order to take backup or to restore snapshot from the cloud, you have to mention all the necessary information regarding the cloud location in the CRD call repository. And also you have to mention the access credential inside a secret and mention this uh, mention this secret uh, uh, inside the repository YAML. And now the repository, I have to mention this repository under the schema YAMLs init section in this following manner. And uh, I have already created the secret and also created the repository while taking the backup. And now I am going to apply the schema manager and uh, restore the snapshot from this repository. And in this uh, demonstration, our database name is demo restore. So uh, let's apply. Schema restore YAML. Okay, so uh, we can see that this is in progress. The schema restore. So, okay, it might take a few mi more minutes to uh, actually restore the whole thing from the cloud. And uh, then it would, we could see everything. So, in the meanwhile, let's see. Uh, yes, the so demo restore has been created and uh, let's get the uh, credentials so you can see that this is already in the current so let's do this to this demo set because okay, so i've got the credentials and Sure. Okay, so uh, you can see the demo restore database. So let's uh, get into this. Okay, show tables. Okay, so we can see that the restore table has been restored uh, successfully. So let's see the data inside. Okay, so you can see that uh, the snapshot has uh, been successfully restored using the schema manager. So in this following manner, uh, you can uh, restore any snapshot uh, which has been taken using stash backup session uh, to with the schema manager into your database while initializing. So thank you.